Hey guys, and welcome to Dennessy playing Tectum episode 9. Uh, I'm recording this before I release episode 8, so I'm asking you in episode 8 um, if I should. There we go. If we should. Um, okay. Um, find another location than the one I have found, because, um... It's, uh, in, in a lot of ways, it's pretty similar to, uh, Pario. And, uh, I, I'm kind of wondering if maybe building this in the same type of location is a bit idiotic, in a sense. But before... I get to read those comments I've already started, uh, if there's any comments, of, of course. Um, I've already started this video because there is a couple of things I really do want to have here. Um, which I'm going to set up even if we are going to have this as a farming village or not. And, the, and it's not a lot of things, it's just a basic kind of... Um, uh, farming stuff that I want, like um, a little bit of a wheat farm, you know, uh, nothing, um, nothing that's going to uh, uh, make uh, ruin having another farming uh, village. Uh, but that is kind of what I want here. So we are gonna go ahead and get these guys out. Maybe those and. Those. Let us go ahead and just get these guys out of here. There, 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 there. Uh, because then we have all the seeds we need here. I forgot the melons. Oh well. Um, and then we have building stuff here and uh, also here. Because I'm thinking uh, I, I had to stop mining sand. Uh, this almost broke. Uh, because I have forgotten to think about unbreaking for it. I'm that good of a Minecrafter, yo. It's almost night time. Uh, so. There we have a bucket. We are gonna go ahead and fetch us some water. And have a little bit of a uh, infinite water. Oh, whoa, no, no. I did not mean to do that. Whee. Because I think having a little bit of a... Um, Water, infinite water source is probably not a bad idea for a farming situation, right? Uh, and I do hope that you guys are having a fantastic day. I for, com uh, I've been meaning to ask, how are you guys doing? Are you guys doing good? Are you guys doing fantastic? I'm sorry about the little lag we are getting. I. Uh, I got a couple of prog programs running, which I probably don't even need to have, and... Okay. So I did not pick up water. That's good to know. There we go. That should be better. That should be wa uh, actual water. Uh, so what I'm kind of thinking... Is, uh, uh, if we fill in this hole right here, uh, and, uh, we can start off the farming area right here, right? Uh, I, I'm, I'm at least thinking. There we go. And then we should, um, get the dirt. Here, here, there. Okay, that should be good. A good beginning for us. I don't have my coffee. I forgot to brew more coffee. I'm gonna go ahead and get that done in just a second. I just want to get this filled in first. Uh, because why not? Huh? And we are running Optifine, just in case you were wondering why all the blocks are going all the way down instead of, like, here, where it kind of stops. 
But Optifun makes it so that it goes all the way down, and my resource pack makes it so it goes basically all the way down, just so it makes kind of more sense to me. You know? uh, and I don't think I'm running the sky... No, I'm not. I'm not running the sky textures right now. Forgot to turn them on because I were looking around with uh, B double O's uh, resource pack and Wells Knight's resource pack uh, j just to kind of see uh, how it will look with their resource packs because uh, it's not a bad packs, you know. I do like them. I just don't really use them myself because they they, they change a bit too much, in my opinion. Uh, let's see what we're looking for again. Oh, my hope! Completely forgot that I was looking for my hope. <laughs> oh well. So we're gonna have a water source right there. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then a water source right there. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There. One, two, three, four, one. And what we're gonna go in under here. I think we're gonna go in under here. There we go. And uh, that should give us a little bit of stuff to get started with, at least. You know? There and there. Okay. Um, that is a beginning, I suppose. I'm kind of hoping making this uh, farming village is going to give us uh, one advancement, which would be kind of cool to have. Let's see, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Punching some of these guys out. Good, good. And then we're going to start off with this side and then off to here and off to here. Right. Two, three, four. And then we're just gonna go like this. And the farming situation is gonna spread oh spread upwards here a little bit, I think. So if we go in under here, maybe right there. We can have it a little bit better. Uh let's see, can we get down from here without breaking the farm? Yes, we can. That is awesome. And another thing that I want to get going pretty soon, 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 is I would like to have, let's see, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right? Then it can kind of climb up like that and, uh, gonna give us a little bit better time, in my opinion. We're not gonna go too far up hill with this it's uh, just gonna go a little bit um, so if we also go in under here that and there one two three four one two three four and that should be I don't think I want it any taller than that um, or any higher up just because. But we are gonna have a couple of them going on the side there as well. Uh, just because we can. And that means that we're gonna go one, two, three, four. Over here. There we go. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then we're gonna go, I think, right here. Yeah. Just uh, flying back down because it's uh, safer for the farm. And I think right there. Like right here. There we go. And there. And then we can go. One, two, there. Okay. We don't need it to go any further than that, to be honest. 
and then we can go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I keep on forgetting my own color codes. That's fantastic. That's great job. Good job. That is Minecraft in a nutshell or something. And then we're just going to go ahead and do that. And we're going to go ahead and go the same right here. Like so. Like so. Like so. Come on. Thank you. And then we can go ahead and bring uh, these seeds going this way as well. I think that was all of them. Yep. Yeah. Uh, anyway, we can uh, continue on with the next portion of this, which is going to be one, two, three, four, here. And then it's going to be one, two, three, four, there. And one, two, three, four, one, two, under here. Just because we can. And we're gonna go ahead and throw this one in first. There. And there we go. One, two, three, four. And then we can throw water into the last one as well. Uh, we are also going to build a house in this area. Uh, just to kind of have have it done, you know. But we are gonna go ahead and get the last bit here in order. Like so. And then we're gonna go ahead and uh, take a sleep and then I'm, then I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a cup of coffee because I need coffee. I need it. I need something hot to sip on while I'm doing this. We will be back in just a second. Okay, we are back. And uh, we brought us a cup of coffee. A cup of coffee is all you need to have a fantastic start to your day, unless it's the beginning of the night. And it's not so fantastic. I'm just kidding. Um, it is actually the morning here, but I've been up all night because my daily schedule is... Uh, basically non-existent. I have, uh, I've been doing some, uh, work around here. Not, uh, not anything visible. Uh, more like, uh, mining and, um, basically, um, just taking care of a, a few minor things over at Perio, uh, which you probably won't even notice if I go back there. Um, one thing you wouldn't notice is I've killed all the cows. <laughs> I killed all the cows and, um, kind of made myself ready to pack and get out of there because, uh, I want to get to the new s stage, so to speak, new area, and, um, have some fun there, building some new stuff, building in a new style. Uh, doing some, um, doing some uh, historical um, research and that kind of stuff, like I've done for the farming area. And actually, that is also something I've done last night. Done a, just a little bit of research on uh, the new area which we are going to be building at, uh, because we uh, we need to know why it's important. That it's a farming village. What, what is the backstory here? Uh, why is farming all they are focusing on here? And um, the reason for that is because uh, it is uh, a. Uh, it's based on neo neolithic, neolithic, uh, the neolithic age, uh, which is basically the ending of the Stone Age. Uh, and I think that's kind of fitting for uh, Minecraft, uh, especially for this world, because if you look at it, we have been in the Stone Age now uh, for quite some time. 
um, in techno technological um, instance. Uh, because I... And the only redstone -y thing that I've done in this world so far is the AFK fishing farm, uh, which is not my design. It's, um, I don't remember whose it is. I think it's Panda or uh, Panda something. Not 100% certain, but I know it's not my design. And uh, I want to give credit to the right person. I think it's Panda something. Go go ahead and check down in the description. I will likely, if I remember to, I will likely link his YouTube page to this video. I think that's correct. So what we're going, uh, what we're doing now is we are gonna go for uh, potatoes as well. I think here, yeah. Uh, because we need potatoes in this area as well. We can't just live on this, you know. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Right there. There. And that should be it. Am I right? So, one, two, three, four. So out to here. Meaning we need to remove this. The, this grass, I mean. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's based on uh, Neolith uh, uh, Neolithic age, um, and I think that's kind of awesome. Um, going about it like a realistic world, um, and I also have the name of the area as well. Uh, and it's going to be Vella, Vella, which is Latin for farming, or farm. One of those. It's uh, it's Latin for agricultural things, at least something. It 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 fits the purpose of the town, and um, that is kind of what I want in this series. The name to actually means something for the area actually be related to what it's for. Uh, unless it's just gonna be a village like that one, then it's gonna be something weird like Ario, which basically means spawn. Uh, basically, and not, not actual, but basically. Um, I don't think there was a word in Latin for spawn. Uh, I think I'm not 100% sure. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, I do like that. I do want what I'm saying to be correct. So uh, if that means being corrected, I love it. Just FYI. Uh, but yeah, that is uh, kind of the purpose and the name of the area. If um, if this isn't going to be the new village. Uh, then it's uh, still gonna be called Bella. It's still gonna be the farming area, but it's uh, that's not gonna be what we're gonna be focusing on. Um, because what I, uh, I have a few a few things planned for this area, and um, one of the reasons I want the farming things to be over here is because you know spawn chunks gonna keep this thing loaded at all times and um there we go and i think that's kind of cool um and then we're gonna need a little bit of a um don't have a lot of life left on my shovel uh i think we're just gonna build it here we're gonna have a little bit of a house for the farmer who lives here, or the farmers, if it's gonna be a village, uh, it's up to you. Uh, but um, we at least need a one house here, and it's uh, it's not gonna be something fancy, uh, because um, seeing as this is the end of the Stone Age, people have started to come out of the caves um, and started to actually build something, but they're not good at building yet. You know, uh, so I'm thinking about either using cobblestone 
or using sandstone. I'm not 100% sure. Let's uh, let's just check. We're gonna go with cobblestone, I think. I did check out a little bit of uh, photographs of a typical Stone Age building. Uh, and it's basically a... Um, what I could find, of course, uh, was basically just, so to speak, a circle. So we're, we're gonna go a little bit like this, I think. And how many was that? One, two, three, four, five. Four, five. And one, two, one. One, two. And I don't think the building that I saw had a, spe a special type of uh, roof on it. But um, that doesn't mean we can't have one. I think we're not going to go for a roof here, because uh, I want it to be as accurate to the photograph that I found as I possibly can. Because why would I otherwise use photograph for inspiration or ideas, you know? Two, three, four, five. Then we're going to go one, two, one, one, two. I think we're gonna have a little bit of an opening right here, like so, just so the people who live here can kind of come and go as they please, and it's going to be at least four uh, blocks tall, five, five. Oh, and one other thing I completely forgot about. There we go. That's gonna be a bit better, I hope, if we don't crash. I don't know, I think my computer needs a little break pretty soon. Um, so I'm going to finish recording, and then I'm going to um, restart. Uh, I'm going to upload episode 8 of Tectum, and then I'm gonna restart the computer when I wake up. footsteps uh, let me check one more thing oh. no I just want to check it uh, because I think that maybe the lighting will be a little bit different if I have it like that instead uh, not that big of a difference I think That's the moon, at least. I wonder how dark it's gonna get. I'm kind of curious. I, I kind of want to see how dark it's gonna get. I can't sleep. There are monsters right on... I think if we go there, we can sleep. I don't think it's gonna get any darker than this, to be honest. Oh, there we go. Uh, if I turn the brightness down, it's gonna get really dark, I think. I just want to see I'm not gonna be staying up all night. I just want to see how dark it's gonna get. I think this is the darkest. Okay. May not rest now. There we go. I think this is the darkest it's gonna get for some reason, but you know what? That's fine. Doesn't really matter. What? Uh, I think that's a bit too too bright. There we go. I think that's gonna be better. Uh, so what we were doing was we were building a little bit. That's all the cobble I have. I think we're gonna go one, two, three, four. Uh, gonna be different heights in the columns as we go on. But I just want, I just kind of want a little bit of something else as well. Just 
a little bit of this, I think. And then we're gonna go ahead and bring this one down like so. That's what we're gonna do here. And... There we go. Okay, I think. I think that's good. Uh, I can't be certain. No, not those. There we go. Okay. Uh, so let me get the walls up to the height where I want them, about here. And uh, we will be back when I'm done with that. Okay, so we have done a little bit of work. I uh, raised the walls around it a little bit. And I kind of want, want it to look like the walls have fallen out of its place a little bit. Uh, like uh, adding a little bit of this somewhere. Um, maybe even adding it like so. Just to kind of give it a little bit of a fallen down uh, illusion. Which we can do even better, I believe. Uh, if we go for these guys as well, and we go for a few buttons, like so, maybe even a few pressure plates, like so, uh, maybe that'll even help us a little bit here. Um, just, just wanting to see. Uh, I'm not, I'm not sure if it's gonna be any help, but who, who knows? Suddenly you are surprised, you know? Just a little bit of tech... A uh, little bit of work like this, you know? Come on. I, that's not the way I want you. Do you only go one way? Are you serious? That's kind of lame. Uh, but if we take a little bit of a look at this from a little... Uh, stop flying. If we take a little bit of a look on that, I think it looks fine, but it needs a bit more texture in it, right? Like, uh, it, it looks fine, but it could look even better. Know what I mean? Like, um, there's always room for improvement in these kind of things. Uh, just my opinion. There. Maybe right here we're gonna go for gravel. Maybe as well there. Oh, it just falls to mill pieces. Okay. I was kind of hoping it would kind of fall down and just land there. I wonder... I think that's better, at least. So if we do that, maybe, and maybe add... Oh. Do that one, and then we could perhaps check if that could work. Maybe something like that works? I think so. I think that works. I uh, could probably do it a bit better, but... That's not really... Uh, we're, I don't think we're gonna be spending too much time on the side here anyway. Uh, but it's kind of nice to see... Um, uh, that it's kind of fallen a little bit apart here. I think maybe we're gonna do the same on the inside. I think so. I think that works a whole lot better. And I also want to add something into the wall here. Maybe not right there. Maybe right here. Yep. And maybe right here. And maybe right here. Just to kind of texturize it a little bit as well. Um. Not because uh, they would different types of textures in this age, 
But just to kind of give it a little bit of a... Uh, just to make it a bit interesting. There. And let's see. I think we're actually going to throw in this one right there. Give it a little bit of a hold as well. There. And maybe right there. Uh, also, this one I forgot about. You go with that one, I think. Let's see how it looks from the outside. Because that's kind of what I'm... I'm more worried about how it looks on the outside. And it looks a whole lot more run down. But I think we need one very spe specific thing before we continue. Because I want to give it a little bit of an overgrown feeling to it. I think we're actually going to get rid of that. Uh, I don't think we're going to have that one. But I do think we're going to go something like that maybe. And uh, something like that. And then we're going to go ahead and throw some vines up. These guys are probably going to grow upwards or downwards and kind of give it a little bit more texturizing. And I think that is a whole lot better uh, because I want, uh, we're not going to be living in this age, you know, uh, but I want it to have this kind of um, palm together kind of feel. And I think that's what we're going to do for the whole thing. Uh, texturizing, give it, giving it a little bit of textures like this and these kind of details and then i think that should be it for this episode i'm gonna continue with this uh, i'm gonna see you guys in the next episode because i do believe we are out of time for this one uh, i hope you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy it don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and uh, most importantly don't forget to have an awesome day i will see you guys in the next episode Okay, bye-bye.